Ladies and gentlemen, it's Premises 187. Look at what has arrived in the mail today. What could it possibly be? Um, it's an electric scooter, guys. The company decided to send me another one to try out. And this is called a Kirin. Here we go. We're just going to do a little unboxing here. I'm pretty excited, so... So here we have it guys, I don't know if you can see it there, it's got a 350 watt motor in there, and I'm liking that, let's just, just stop talking and open this thing up. Here we go, right off the bat, that's pretty solid, it's my first impression, it looks pretty damn robust. I watched a video on their website where they were throwing this thing around across the floor and it just jumped on it and it was riding like nothing happened. Look, handlebars. So how I imagine this works is you pop that little latch down and it comes up like so. It's got a side stand. How about we use it? Something connects up with that. I'm pretty sure after I've done this, it's ready and done. But I need two hands for this. Be right back. BRB. Okay, she's together now. Hey. It's looking nice. So what do you get for your money? Well, let's start off at money, shall we? For £225, this, is, this actually comes out as being one of the cheapest adult scooters you can buy. But now I'm going to rattle off on why the cheapest isn't always the worst. So we have a 350 watt motor. Most scooters come with a 250 motor. The wheels are 8 inch honeycombed, so they're airless, you cannot puncture them. We also have a front shock absorber, again, something that's not always found on these electric scooters. Within the body of this scooter we have a 6 amp hour battery that's capable of hauling you 25 kilometers. The rear wheel houses the motor and it's capable of up to 25 kilometers per hour. The Kirin S1 also has a revolutionary braking system because being able to stop is kind of a big deal. So, on the right we have our throttle, on the left here we have our electronic braking system. If you hold down the throttle for 5 seconds it will engage a cruise control mode, it's pretty cool. Holding this button turns the scooter on, and here we have a nice little battery readout and speedometer. Tapping this button will change the speed mode. We have three modes to choose from. Now if you triple tap the button, we will get our nice beamy LED headlights. We also have a brake light which actually flickers when you engage the brakes. This scooter even has Bluetooth connectivity and you can pair it up with your phone and the app actually gives you a few extra features like the option of choosing between kickstart and zero start. What we do here is go back, 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 back. back. Ha 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 
<laughs> oh Jesus, I've got a headache. Oh. Okay, so now I'm going to demonstrate the cruise control and I'm also going to test out that revolutionary braking system. When you've reached top speed and you've held down the throttle for five seconds, you'll hear a... The scooter will now hold this speed until you press another button. But now we're going to brake. And here are my final thoughts on the Kieran S1. Overall, I'm, I'm really enjoying it. This is my first electric scooter, so I don't have a great deal of experience to go by when criticizing this. I weigh just under 15 stone, and I feel that that 350 watt motor really helps with propelling this scooter. As I demonstrated earlier, the braking system is very efficient at stopping you. One thing I will complain about regarding the brakes is the lever doesn't give you any progressive braking. The moment you tap that lever it's giving you 100% brake force. So what I do is just quickly dab the brake lever to reduce speed. The only other critique I can give is the front suspension is very firm and it gets quite chattery on uneven surfaces. I'd say those are two mild annoyances. Let's just remember this is one of the cheapest adult scooters. It is jam packed with features. It is bang for buck king. If you're interested in buying yourself a Kieran S1, check out the links in my description. Geek Buying is given a very generous discount to my viewers. Also guys, remember it's your responsibility to be familiar with the local laws regarding e-scooters. I do believe the government will be running a trial soon here in the UK. Thank you very much for watching. Um, even if you're not after an e-scooter, do check out Geek Buying. They are one of the few companies that actually look out for your boy premises and give me great opportunities like this. And as always, ride safe.